Well, JC was talking about REITs making a new all-time high. And so today we have a pretty unique REIT, which is Lamar Advertising. $12 billion market cap with less than 500 followers on StockTwits. It owns approximately 30% of all the billboards in the United States. So it's the single largest billboard operator here in North America. Stock is trading at fresh all-time highs. And if you guys want to go to that next slide, you can see it's breaking out of this 30-month base. So absolutely beautiful here. If the stock is above... 124 it looks like the path of least resistance is higher and we can put a stop below 120 uh, but being a REIT Lamar also pays a four percent dividend so I don't know if this qualifies in JC's young aristocrats list but it's kind of a little cherry on top to uh to get that dividend well the young aristocrats are going to be stocks that have raised their dividends for five consecutive years between five and nine consecutive years especially I think this is getting close then I think this is getting close I think it's been about two years and again, this will probably be the most popular segment or its own show at some time as StockTwits finds more time. Think about where we are with stuff like this, right? JC can go top down on monthly candlesticks, but guys like Riley who are using StockTwits, which is free, can run these spreads. What is Lamar really saying? First of all, good point on a REIT. You can earn T-bill type rates with a stock that's like underfollowed and, and pretty much tied to the global economy in, in many ways. 484 followers on StockTwits. This stock is making all-time highs. There's nothing more boring seemingly than outdoor billboards. But here's the secret about that. Outdoor billboards are really not boring. They're actually incredibly interesting. And I will tell you this, that by the end of next year, you're going to be hearing about this Lamar and how they're using AI and electronic billboarding to know who is driving in a certain area at a certain time of day, what demographic. And they're going to be like, okay, Oh, it's old people who are overweight. Here's your Ozempic sign. So they're going to be using AI too. So really, it's not so boring. I have been focusing on electronic billboards for 20 years. Love it. Yes, they have data. They have inventory. Good point. Very good point.